Hello everybody, welcome back to another musical e-gaming video. Today we are in Karma Mechanic Simulator 18. Of course today we are going to be taking some uh, odd jobs. Uh, working towards, hopefully, restoring yet another car. Uh, the truck you see here, the Smith 1500, I restored fully in my 24 hour stream. I did, of course, I just finished that stream yesterday this is going this out the same day that i'm recording it completely restored i just need to get the paint shop so i can repaint it and then possibly sell it all right let's see what we got yeah story order as we raise our career is progressing i've made some money from uh, the internet well from some internet videos and i'm ready to tweak this beast a little you know, uh, the light goes green and I really step on it. I feel I have to work harder than before. Um, by the way, the car doesn't feel as comfortable as it should. Do something about that interior and uh, see if the engine needs to tune up or something. Let's see what we got. Really? Okay. I was looking for a racer, but... Oh my goodness. Alright. Oh. Jesus Christ. Um, gearbox. Yeah. Gearbox looks like it's bad. Uh, front exhaust. The, uh, um... Drive axles. Probably imagine maybe the tie rods. Something. Yeah. But first, let's do an OBD test. Run some tests on it. Yep. Go through uh, the works here. Oh Park my! plugs, ignition coils. Yep. Good to know it's a four cylinder. Okay. Yep. Spark plugs and ignition coils are on there. Okay. Good. Do a compression test real quick. Green, that's good. Yep. That's Ooh, not. bad pistons. Two bad pistons. That engine's coming apart. Yep. That's the battery. Starter, radiator fans, alternator, that's all good, so, let's go ahead and take it to the dyno, and can it start the engine, good. Mm, that's good to know. We'll go to lifter 2. Lifter on up, buttons on the other side. If only there was a button box on either side of these lifts, <laughs> so I don't have to walk around the whole damn thing. Yeah, drain the oil, drop the uh, gearbox so I can take the engine out of the car and put it on the rack. Lifter 2. Drain that oil. I can move that bus. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Start taking stuff And I gotta lower it, get the starter off. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Well, as soon as I get the engine out, I can take it apart on the bench. <laughs> which makes it hell of a lot easier instead of finagling around this entire engine and raising it up and down every five seconds. Wheels gotta come off too. Wheel drive axle. Yep. Probably bad brakes as well. Uh, rotors. The looks of it. Yeah. 
But I'm gonna get the engine running first and then I'll uh, put it on the dyno. shaft and gearbox Whoa. that clutch needs to yep. be done bring her on down Exhaust section. Bring it back up. Nope. Oh. Heat shield. Exhaust manifold, and then gotta raise it. My phone's ringing off the hook. Oh yeah. Fourteen. Uh, no, not fourteen. Five calls in waiting. Stand. Ignition coils, spark I know plugs. bad spark plugs. Oh, throttle. Throttle for the intake. Head cover. There's a lot of stuff around here that is redone. Jesus. Ooh. Time cover. Actually, the time cover doesn't look that bad. Time and cover I can repair. Steering off of there. Mm -hmm. um. Whoa, camshafts. Too bad camshafts. Uh, fuel yeah, rail is going bad as well. Fuel rail, you said? Yeah, the fuel rail is in the 20s. Where's the bad piston? If only I had the compression test kit, that would have been nice. Okay. Rotate you. This is only a four cylinder. Yeah. Makes it easier. Well, I know for a fact we have 
At least a bad piston. At least one bad piston. Almost got though. Just keep it that way. Our engine is a part. Okay. Head cover. Still got several things that yeah, but that could be a suspension so. or something too. Yeah. Engine. Slowly start getting stuff put back together. Fuel filter. I don't think you need to fill filter yet. Power steering. Track shaft. Shaft is still good. Alternator still good. Piston with Conrad, I have two pit, two bad pistons. You have two bad ones. So I'll do. Yep. bad pistons. Oof. I need to get some new crankshaft bearing caps. New bearing caps. Got twenty three thousand in the bank for this. Nice. Piston rings are going to be. Uh, same. If I got to get one new uh, rod cap. The others are repaired. The other ones I repaired, uh, one of them died, destroyed in the aftermath. Filter. Ooh, flywheel. Needs to be changed, but I'm not going to worry about the flywheel until we get the rest of that. Engine head. Camshaft times two.
cam shift times two. And might as well get two cam gears as well. I need spark plugs. Four ignition coils. I believe all four were bad, weren't they? Yes. I need a new throttle. Fourteen. New timing cover. Where's the spark plug? camshafts brand new oh not that one that is. use the special parts on uh, a different one Engine head cover needs to be replaced as well. Where is it? Engine head cover fourteen. Coils. And a new fuel rail. Fuel rail fourteen. Fuel rail is it? Oh, I. It's gonna be an expensive job. Mm -hmm. Intake manifold can still be used. Idler, well, not the new idler roller, but a idler roller in there. I think that's the engine done. I don't see anything else besides the. Um, you got the new spark plugs and everything in, right? Yep. Alright, cool. So, take you off. Install into the vehicle.
Oh, Clutch. I need new exhaust manifold. Yep. Clutch pressure plates. Front drive shaft. Front axle C's. Your box. Pressure plate. Oh, quick plate. Pressure plate. Bearing. Flywheel. Your box. 14. Um. Drive shaft. Oh. Son of a. What'd you miss? I gotta take out another piston. Really? Yep. Shit. I gotta take the whole thing apart. Right? Yep. Thank God I didn't put oil in it. Yeah, but don't you gotta get underneath to get the cap out? Yep. Uh, you should've took it back out. I could have sworn we got that entire engine done. But, oh well. Battle, exhaust, intake manifold. Engine. Three new pistons. Shaft. Brand new spark plugs that haven't been used yet. Nice. It's all an art. Taking apart an engine and uh, rebuilding it. Damn gears.
there's still some parts that uh, need, to, need to be done. On the engine? I'm going to be marking off every uh, new piece that I actually put on. I'm in cover. Bring that fully. Water pump. Alternator. I the roller. Uh, serpentine belt B. Tensioner. Serpentine A. I need a front exhaust section. That will be an engine exhaust. Front exhaust section is technically under the engine, to be honest. There we go. Front exhaust section. I need an exhaust manifold. Manifold, and I need get the manifold cover might as well. Yep. Razor on up. I'm gonna go ahead and move. Pressure plate. We build the clutch in this thing. Bearing. Gearbox. A brand new gearbox on an old engine. Yep. That's some of the materials uh, we're going to Exhaust. Need a front drive shaft. Drive shaft. No, front drive shaft. And then it's front drive axle C's. Times two. Outer tie rod, inner tie rod, the steering rack. Yep. Sway bar. Yep. Sway bar. The end links.
Yep. Two sway bar front end link A's, steering rack, sway bar, outer tie rod, inner tie rods. So that's going to be under suspension. Steering rack. Front sway bar. Two inner tie rods. Two outer tie rods. Two sway bar and like A's. Steering rack. What else? There we have the exhaust manifold. I'm not doing anything with the brakes because they didn't ask me to do the brakes. Sway bar, link A, linking it to the shock, so the sway bar links the uh, shocks together. Oh, other the wheel, I like how some parts you actually have to put together. Or you put them on the car, like the wheels and the springs. Yeah. Bring it down, I need to put the starter in, as well as uh, the exhaust manifold. Starter. Exhaust manifold. The old manifold cover on. And it's done. Nice. Oh. oh. <laughs> What's the car back up? Uh, I guess it's not done. Guess I forgot to put the oil pan and back. You've got to put oil in it. Yeah. Oil pan and oil. Oh, rod cap as well. New rod cap. There's a reason why I don't do this in real life. <laughs> yeah, that could have been bad. Uh, well, it wouldn't have worked because the rod cap for one of the pistons wasn't on, as well as the oil pan and oil itself. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Checked. Perfect. Looks good. And Let's see if any of the error codes went away. <laughs> yep. We're good. Mm -hmm. How much was that made? Like 8,000. Yeah. Just shy of $10,000. For one job anyway guys that's going to be the end of today's video thank you all for watching and i will see you in the next one take care